effect. All citizens, please remain in your homes. Do not be deceived by unverified information. Unverified information, my ass! You can't trick us anymore! Everyone, please calm down. Do not leave your domiciles without permission. The government was tricking us! Who's going to believe you now? There's more confusion than I thought. People were already on edge after Seiron's rebellion. Their reaction is completely warranted after being shown a video like that. Nagi's not here. Maybe the National Defense Forces took him. I'll have Wataru check later. I'm assuming you all saw the video as well? Yeah, we did. A lot of it was information we learned in Togetsu, but it carried more weight coming from the Chief. We used Arahabaki knowing this would happen. I don't regret anything I've done. But to live with what we did, we need to change New Himuka. Someone is coming. An enemy? What? I don't believe it. Good. Finally. I've been looking for you. Major General Fubuki! I've been worried about you. We haven't seen each other since the old OSF hospital. Karin saved me at the last second. Next thing I noticed, Seiron had taken me in. Seiron? I'm glad you're alive, but it looks like you're hurt. Are you okay? Nothing to worry about. More importantly, there's something I need to tell you, Ito. Me? Togetsu has sent people after you. We managed to drive them off because we noticed their movements early enough. But there could be more next time. I want you to be careful. Wait, the whole Togetsu detachment? You took them out by yourself? I just talked. It was the Seiron forces that did the actual fighting. You got Seiron to take action? You act like that's not even a big deal. Just how in the world did you manage to even do that? I was afraid they'd not only be after Kasane, but Yuito as well. Anyway, we're finally together again. I'm sure we all have a lot to discuss, so why don't we go back to the hideout? Are you even in any condition to walk? You look pretty haggard. Perhaps I'm a little sleep deprived, but rest is not exactly an option right now. We should get somewhere safe. And Major General! <laughs> Are you okay? <laughs> that shouldn't have been funny. <laughs> Don't cause a scene or you'll gather attention. That shouldn't have been funny. He needs to rest. So let's go to my platoon's hideout for now. So this is where your hideout is. It looks like the same type of unit as our hideout. The make is identical. How is the major general? I gave him first aid. The setting and seems to have you can see it. So he is resting. Wataru's sister. You can see why <laughs> they made him so twinkish. <laughs> they gotta be similar it enough. Like he overused his power. You could see the exhaustion in his face. We should let him rest. Don't worry, he's not in any real danger. He's a lot tougher than he looks. <sighs> That's good. I guess we need to wait to talk to him. So, are you guys okay sharing this hideout with everyone? It's going to be a little crowded. That would be convenient. We should sort our belongings then. Kagero, what are you going to do about Yuito? I think it's probably best we decide on something. <laughs> oh, you're going to bring that up. I guess that makes sense. I promise you I'm giving it some thought. Just give me a little more time. <sighs> Did they not realize they were within fucking earshot? <laughs> we're in the same room! We visit places and take on quests. 
Sometimes you might find you... Wait, so side quests is an hour thing? Side quests is now a thing? Yuka and Kagro. What were they talking about? I feel like I heard my name. You did. It seems serious. Maybe. No. Okay, so. Much bigger group now. We'll just have to share the hideout with each other. Are you talking about me? You don't have to be so nasty. I'll clean up. I wasn't trying to be mean. I guess I have to deal with this all the time now. You see, this is why this is why you a twink. <laughs> this is why you a twink. <laughs> all right. You don't like me, do you, Sheena? He doesn't. You still saved me, though. Thanks. You know, just because I saved you doesn't mean I think you're any good. I don't exactly hate you, though. You're so full of it. There are a lot. There are a lot of people talking. There are a lot of goddamn Bond episodes to do. This has got to be a thing. Oh no, I have to kit out everyone. <laughs> oh no, I have to kit out everyone. I have to kit out. Oh no, because you you okay? No, you come pre, pre kitted out. All right, good. So oh, that would have been a thing. Okay, no, they're already pre kitted out. That's good. But what we have to deal now, what we have to deal with now, is everyone wants sucking something. Get you an anti lamp. Get you some foliage. Two of those, one of these. One of these. One of these, man, we are gonna be here for a hot minute. Don't have the answer for that, have the answer for that. Everyone here needs these upgrades. Okay. Well. Whom's the fuck? Sharing our knowledge is what saved you, Mito. Thanks, Luca. I should be thanking you. We needed everyone there to keep Yuito alive. I think you all did wonderfully. Good. Okay, well. We got a lot of gifts to give. Let's talk to the ones that don't have Bond episodes first. There's a cushion for you, boy.
Thank you. I don't know why you need a cushion, but... Mm, sure, okay. <laughs> let's let's go with that. You have a Bond episode, but we're not going to do that. I, we are going to do that. Fuck, never mind. <laughs> Gemma, got a minute? What is it? Did something happen? I had Wataru go through the list of retired soldiers after we talked about your friend. I told him he was missing since I thought that was important. I'm sorry. Well, that's fine. Nobody's trying to hide that. So, did you find out anything? I haven't looked yet. I thought you might be able to notice something if we looked at it together. I'm sending the data to you now. This lists the present status of retired OSF members. I told him to only look at members who retired this past spring, so I'm pretty sure your friend is on here. Oh, I found him. Masaki Fujikawa. There's even details on his living situation. Why is the OSF tracking retired members so thoroughly? Wait, what? What's wrong? This is ridiculous. Look here. Let's see. Shortly after entering the OSF hospital, Masaki Fujikawa died? No. I don't buy it. If he died in the hospital, his family would have been notified. Something doesn't add up. You're right. There are too many here that are listed as dying in the hospital, and all of them in such short periods. No matter how supposedly damaged these retired soldiers are, they can't all need hospitalization that badly. Hey guys, so I dug a little deeper on that retirement list you're talking about. Seems pretty clear to me these are doctored. Publicly, they all died in the hospital. However, there's no record of their bodies being moved. There's a chance they're still alive in there. Really? I can't say for sure, but they went through the trouble of falsifying these records. Which means there's a high chance the hospital is involved in something unsavory. Are they being used in human experiments? Many retired soldiers don't have families. It's a horrible thing to say, but nobody's asking questions if they turn up missing. I'd like to say it's only a guess, but going by the OSF hospital's previous track record? Then we should get on this now. If they're being used in human experiments, we need to save them right away. Data. Huh. The data lists them being admitted to the new OSF hospital building. But maybe they were moved to the old building for experimentation. That's possible, but there's actually something else suspicious I found. I was tracking the vehicles going to and from the OSF hospital to see what they're up to. And I found a strange vehicle that would head from the hospital to Ceyron once in a while. There's actually one out now. I can't imagine they'd be making deals with Ceyron right now. What are they doing? I don't know, but they could be transferring the patients to some facility we're not aware of. We should start by tracking down that vehicle, since that's our only lead. They need to cross the river if they're heading to Ceyron. We should be able to find it if we head to Mizuhagawa. I'll see if I can find more info on it. Thank you for helping me find Masaki. Let's find him soon. Yeah, is it just a solo fight again? It is! Let's go! I do enjoy how, like, it's, it's just like, nah, yeah. Big. <laughs> it's just big do-it-yourself. You and the one guy. Go. Again, though, it's not really a challenge, so it's less less hype, but I like the idea. Because I can still... I, like, look at this. I have access to all powers still. I've got good news, you two. I managed to access the details of that vehicle leaving Suo through its ID number. I was right. The cargo manifest listed names of hospital patients. Your friend Masaki was on it. Then he's on that vehicle. Yeah, there's definitely a chance of that. It's stopped right now. I'll send you its location. You need to get over there ASAP. No, oh, right. No, 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 there are. There are. There are. Grab you. If we can, we may as well. Watch out for 
electric attack. You won't be able to move if you're electric. Now I can take it easy. You wanna get up? I swear if you just hold the button, he's meant to go up. But oh well. Nope, never mind. I'm gonna be down for a hot second. Alright, alright, fine. We'll just stick to the normal fucking powers just so I can teleport to you fuckers. Oh, I can't use that with them yet. God damn it. Alright, fair enough. It's gonna take... I wish, I wish it was a smoother... I wish it was... Like, I can do it quickly, but I wish it was smoother than having to double tap the button. That's the vehicle Wataru was talking about. What is it doing stopped there? They're unloading something. They look like garbage bags. I don't see any patients. Probably in the garbage bags. So it was a garbage truck? Does that mean Wataru's information was wrong? Probably in the no. garbage bags. They'd be taking trash to the garbage facility. So what are they? Probably Let's bodies. Check their contents after they leave. I'm getting a bad feeling. Yeah. It's targeting that bag. But why? Bodies. It's what I feared. No, stay away from that. Gemma! Damn it. I guess we're doing this. Do what you want. Hey yo, a quick one. Everything. Get it fucked. <laughs> hey yo, quick one. Get fucked. Okay, that? What health was I on? That should not have taken that much health that quickly. How what? I... Man, this is one of the few times I wish I was streaming and not recording so I could rewind in real time. How much health was I on? I couldn't have been that low. Because the, the fucking noise would have been going off constantly. I am aware of. Okay, why did you give me a tutorial for DT like seven hours after I unlocked DT? You've given me that tutorial before. Do what you want. I am very confused. I can do this. You should be able to break the outer shell if you keep attacking. Let's go. Let's go. 
Oh, one of these boys. Two of these boys! Okay, that's gonna be a thing. Uh, that sort of was very limp dicked. <laughs> yo, this, yo, this is some goddamn nonsense. It's gonna take me a hot second, but like we can do it. We can adjust. I'm sorry. Seems like I jumped to the wrong conclusion. I misidentified the cargo. I never thought they'd be carrying human brains in the waste disposal vehicle. Then those bags are. Damn it! It was too late. Masaki's already... Not just him. They treated all these people like they were trash. They fought for decades, risking their lives to fight for humanity. None of them deserve to end like this. <sighs> I'm sorry. I lost my cool for a moment. Anybody would if they found out their friend was treated this way. I'd like to bury the ones who didn't get eaten by the other. Do you mind waiting here? I'll help. Let's give them a proper burial. Thank you. You too, Wataru. I appreciate your help. I'll have to tell Masaki's younger brother later. I don't mean to overstep, but... Would it be okay if I went with you? I'd appreciate that. Yeah, peeps in Discord are really just like, well, and Twitter are just like, what you the fuck was this? <laughs> was this yes. anniversary stream? Something I need to tell you about Masaki. I'm sorry, but your brother has died. What? Are you certain? Yes, yes. generic NPC-looking man. I can't share the details with you as it's classified. But he passed away in the hospital and was buried in a secret location. Oh, I'm sad to hear that. I'm sorry. If I'd only found him sooner. It's okay. Please allow me to apologize as well for calling you cold. Huh? I actually received a message from my brother after I spoke to you, saying he had to be taken into the hospital. He told me not to worry about him and that he might not be able to contact me for a while. He also shared his true feelings. Let me send you his message. He... My brother was thankful to you for your tough love, for trying to help him move on from the OSF. 
After everything we've been through together, I don't have to talk to him to know what he's thinking. Gimma was always there for me, awkward and earnest. Masaki. It was my misunderstanding. My brother's memories of you were always there helping him. My brother wrote that he was ready to build a new life, free from the past, once he's discharged from the hospital. Unfortunately, Ooh. that never happened. But he never would have had that hope if it wasn't for you. Thank you for saying that. I'm glad I was able to meet you today. Goodbye. <sighs> Gamma? You knew what I was trying to do. Your brains weren't connected, but your hearts were. Masaki. Is he crying? <laughs> Sorry. We should go back to the hideout. Okay. All right, buddy. Well, that worked out. That, um... Yeah, <laughs> okay. Just casually throwing the fucking brains in bin bags is what's weird, man. Like, what the fuck? Nani the fuck? Yuito, will you train with me later? It yeah, sure. Harder when someone is with me. Sure. Oh, but take it easy on me. You train pretty hard. Got it. I'll be careful. I mean, I'm not gonna try and crush you with weights or anything. Yet. I'm devoting myself to becoming your shield. That's what I think is most important right now. Hey, one level five, let's go. Automatic. Wait a minute. Was that level six? Automatic. Do whatever you think is right, Yuito. Thanks. I don't have to second guess anything when you're with me. Why did Luca level up from that? Luca wasn't there. <laughs> Bitch, you weren't there. Oh god, we're in we're in the group chat with the twins. That was it. Cringe. <laughs> My guy. Alright, but I had to give you a gift as well. Oh no, I'm giving you both of these already. Yeah, alright, never mind. Uh, you have a Bond episode. Everyone has a goddamn Bond episode. Jesus. Let's give you gears first. She thinking about that what? dick. No, no, I was just admiring that dick. Admiring what? Oh, uh, like you and everyone else. I was hoping I'll always be with all of you. Mostly that dick. <laughs> Mostly that dick, though. Flame front. Wait a minute. <laughs> Wait a minute. Hey, bond level three for the team. Let's go. White battle attire. I feel like you really trust me. Of course, I trust you the most. White battle attire, you say?
Hmm. No, because you're cringe. Hmm. I'll be like, oh, you know what? Actually, never mind. I was about to say I prefer the white, but you know what? That uh, that looks pretty good on you. I'm gonna be real. Hey, that looks good on you. I ain't gonna lie. That works. Yeah, it looks alright. <laughs> alright, so Samuki and Gamma are the ones that it works with, like the most. Alright. Where you gone? Actually, do I have gifts for you? I don't even remember. Oh, I gave you a plant, didn't I? Alright, yeah. Alright, let's go hang out. Oh, Yuito. Do you have a minute? There's something I want to talk to you about. Did something happen? You look serious. I got a message from my uncle. You mean the OSF hospital's chairman? Can you tell me what it was about? Yeah, but be ready. You won't like it. He said, It seems you've learned a lot about the hospital recently, but you don't need to get involved. If you consider yourself a part of the Ichijo family, then keep your mouth shut. He's clearly threatening you. Yeah. I was shocked. But beyond that, I'm just so frustrated. We worked hard to uncover the government's secret, but they're still able to get away with it. We managed to expose so much to the public, but the top brass are trying to save themselves by eliminating the evidence. They can't go unpunished for what they did. Isn't there anything we can do? Are you sure, though? I mean, no matter what they did, they're still your family. Isn't this hard for you? I'm fine. It doesn't matter if they're family. Remember what I told you before? We've seen so many bad parts of the OSF. What my uncle did was unforgivable. I can't look the other way if I'm going to be able to stand proudly as a member of the OSF. Then let's think together on how we can go after the chairman's crimes. We basically need to find irrefutable evidence that my uncle and the others were connected to that research. Yeah, but that data isn't going to be something we can easily access. If there's any evidence left, it would need to be somewhere secret. Oh, like the old OSF hospital. We've That's been there possible. so many fucking times. <laughs> there are others there, so maybe they think nobody would go investigate it. Let's check it out together. We've investigated this place so many fucking times. I say that, but... Come on. I said I'd help you any way I could. Thanks. Let's go together then. anyone here was it closed off it seems like the others have been left alone if there's any evidence left it'd have to be in the basement let's be careful I appreciate how I could have I could just walk past all that nonsense is like now nah, we're good now nah, we're good because like I ain't fighting that bitch Oh, this is a this is a very straight quick one. Look, someone's being attacked by others. Could it be a researcher? We can worry about that later. We need to save her first. You're right. Let's hurry. Ah, stay away! 
Why are you still here? Damn it! There's too many of them. Defeating them would be hard enough. But I'm worried I'm going to hurt her trying to protect her. Ah, that's fine. What are we going to do? Can you create a wall of fire around her to keep the others away? If I do that, the woman would get burned too. Yeah, that's fine. Keep the intensity down and have it pointing towards the outside. That should keep her safe in the center. Fire points. On paper, sure. But my power is hard to control. I'm not sure I can do it. But if we don't do something... Watch out! <laughs> You can do it. I just need you to hold it for a short time while I draw the others away. Okay, I'll try. How did you pass like the uh, training if you can't actually control your power? Fire, do what I say. <sighs> how like how did you get past the actual genuine years of training if your power can't be controlled? Can take care of these guys. Chance. Are you all right? Come this way. What way? Thank you. Trying by fire. I thought I was dead. Can you still fight? Yeah, I'm still good. Now to unleash everything I have. Again, like, how can you not control your power? Like, isn't that like literally? I plugged I plugged you in. I plugged you in if you wanna No? No, are we just not playing this game? Are we Are we just not Oh now you work, okay. Okay, so despite being plugged in during the in that entire cutscene, you didn't want to start up again until we were nearly dead. Fair enough. Cringe, but fair enough. Oh yeah, you can't do fire and electricity at the same time. Let's do this, I forgot about that. Do what you want. Hello? Game? You wanna... No? Nope. Okay, fair enough. Okay? No, that's alright, fair enough. Don't do the don't do the thing I ask, that's that would be cringe. That would be very cringe, fair enough, game. I press buttons and things don't get done. That's cool, I guess. It just be, be, it's just built different, I guess. Games just casually built different sometimes. I wonder if I did Kyoka's power and then I did the uh, mass field, would it double all the uh, items that are thrown? I will have to see about that. I doubt it, but that would be cool. That's all of them. Yeah, thank goodness you came up with that fire idea. 
Sorry I put you on the spot, but I couldn't have protected her without you. Oh, right. Where's the woman we saved? Um, first, let me thank you for saving me. Please. We only did our jobs as members of the OSF. So you're with the OSF like I thought. Why did you come here? Was it to arrest me? Sure. No, we mean you no harm. Wait, are you Yuito Sumaragi, the traitor? Indeed. I guess that means you're not with the government. Okay, I'll trust you. Either way, it doesn't look like I'll be able to get out of here on my own. Can we ask what you came here to do? Are you a researcher here? Yes, I've personally conducted many inhumane experiments here. You're a monster. Cool. But I just couldn't go on with it anymore. Doing those terrible things to innocent people. The guilt kept me awake at night. Then I saw that broadcast and thought it was my chance to atone for what I did. Do you mean the video of Kaito we sent out from Arahabaki? You did that? Then I need to thank you again. That broadcast helped me make up my mind. I need to reveal the truth and have everyone, including myself, receive the proper punishment we deserve. And it seems like we're here for the same reasons. What do you mean? We came here looking for evidence against the people running the hospital. We thought there must be some here. I see. Then I guess we're both lucky. I just retrieved some data from a locked terminal in the back. It lists who was directing the research and for what reasons. It even has signatures with their names. If we can make these public, even the higher ups won't be able to make excuses. That means we'll achieve our objective if we safely escort her back to the city. Yeah. I can't believe you snuck in here by yourself when the place is crawling with others. Hey, she's because she's a scientist. That means she's smart. To avoid the others, it was blocked halfway through, so I had no choice. I was really scared. Well, you're safe now. We'll protect you. I still can't get over how she can't control her power. She went through years of training. And you and you just can't control your power? I can make my own way back from here. Thank you for escorting me this far. It was our pleasure. I feel so relieved to learn there was someone in that hospital with a conscience. And you both gave me hope. A chance to right my mistakes. How do you plan to release the information you found? I plan to take it to the press first, but I'm not sure if there's any organization that's not in bed with the government. If there's not, then I'll think of something else. Okay, good luck. Yes. Thank you. You look relieved. Yeah. I feel like I'm starting to understand what Gemma said the other day. You mean about a reason to fight? Uh-huh. But maybe fighting isn't the only thing I want to do. I thought my pyrokinesis was only good for burning my enemies. But now I see I can use it to protect someone, too. I feel like there's something there. I mean... I'm still working it out, so I'll have to give it some more thought. I'm glad you seem to be onto something. I hope my idea helped. Yeah, it really helped. Thanks. Well, let's head back to the hideout. 